when we have 12 melanated men, mm-hmm. black men, indigenous, how do you classify that when somebody say, hey, what is it that you guys are doing this weekend? And so there's some people I would say, well, we're going to have black men come together. Oh, black is a color. Black is a color. I've never really met a true black person. Tyrone, this is black because I was educated in that room and, and came to find out that that a lot of them elders did history from them as well as far as their role in the transatlantic slave trade. As far as their role in the trans-Sahara slave trade. You know what I'm saying? So I had to put down a lot of my inhibitions and, and, and things that I was thinking, you know, and they had to put down a lot of theirs. But it's gonna take that. It's gonna take this right here. It's gonna take this. Basically from color to black to African American. Uh, speak on music. I had a program director Ooh, tell me man. I can make any song how I want to. Uh, all I got to do is play it for you enough. I promise you, you'll like it. And I'm sure we've all experienced that at some point. I hate this song. <laughs> and, you know, two or three weeks later, you you like, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. <laughs> You've been conditioned. You've heard it enough. The second that you build that negativity, in my opinion, from a psychological standpoint, to say, oh, this is holding me down, or this entity is holding me down, I think you've started your own growth. If you're, if you're from Trinidad or West Indies, uh-huh. but you're not born there, uh-huh. but you have the descendant of, or your parents, or you, you're, you're, you're African American, like okay. you're born in America. Okay. But if I go there, they recognize that I'm not from there. These nine kids with six different baby mamas, that goes the definition of a dead beat day. Uh, put it in short. I like to, cause you guys, man, there's a whole lot of knowledge that was just hitting me. And I'm just like, man, I didn't even think like that. But for me, um, when it came to somebody calling me black, it never came with a positive connotation. I think the term African-American was used to relinquish rights to this land for black people. And mm. I think it was I think it was by design. And I think it's one of the reasons why you don't see European American on anything. Like we did that. Our history is what it is, people. We can't turn from that to embrace anything of true truth in who we are and to be the best versions of ourselves individually and as a collective. It would be in our best interest to embrace that to the fullest capability. I just recently experienced this myself. You know, the people you would sit next to in class, the people you was walking amongst the hallways with, your friends, you was chopping it up. You don't see a lot of those people no more. I think that's the most, tell me about anxiety, of anything that can happen to me. You know, I've, like they said, been around the world, been on planes, planes and drunk, up, 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 down like that. <laughs> nothing, nothing is like that light coming behind me, nothing. Nothing causes me that kind of the way I feel because I feel like I'm not in control no more when that light starts. It's just a feeling. I mean, it's, I can't even explain. Hey, you guys, you may not know it, but we're taking control of our own image right now.